So Rising Leaders is a programme um, where we look to engage females at colleges um, who are from ethnically diverse backgrounds um, and the aim is to bring them onto the programme and bring them on a leadership journey. Um, they've undertaken three in-person days and two online days during the programme and through those days they go through um, behaviours that are relatable to becoming a leader. From my standpoint, someone that knows a lot more than me coming in and telling me how they've done it, even though they started at the same place as me, so maybe a less privileged background in South London or whatever, it's helped me because I know that I can get to where I need to be. For example, Stephanie Boyce, uh, she came in, she was from a low socioeconomic background, also a black woman, she's now the president of the Law Society of Indian and Wales. So I feel like that's inspired me to know that I can reach that and given me the confident I need to reach that point as well. Um, I really like the sessions where we get to like discuss, to hear everyone how they think about this and how they think about that. I think it's opened my mind to the possibilities of what is um, what is possible. But I have many dreams that I want to achieve, I just didn't know how to do it. But from doing the programme and being here today, it's just helped me to come out my shell a bit more and just know that whatever dreams I want to achieve, I'm able to achieve them. At this moment of time, I do have a dream of making an athletics group for people of colour, from both men and females, from like deprived backgrounds. I think being able to say what I think, like I've always been told I shouldn't be saying certain things, but having being able to say them makes makes me feel like I'm maybe like contributing a lot more than what I would usually do, like contribute. I think like unlocking kind of what was kind of hidden inside which I'm too scared to bring out. I think I kind of needed that because after my injury I kind of lost that kind of sense of being a leader. Being in places like Wembley and Lords and now London Stadium, um, I've been inspired to do better. So like I want to be in here all the time. Um, meetings and all these things so I think I've been very inspired. So the Rising Leaders programme has been really important for equality and diversity to ensure that we have a diverse thinking uh, in our future workforce uh, within football and further education. And I think with being inside of this programme, being amongst other women, women that have already gone through this and have been leaders in what they've studied or, or grown their skills in, I think it just it boosts my confidence, you know, it makes me aspire to be that way. Rising Leaders provides the females that are on the programme this year with the opportunity to input and shape what the programme will look like in the future. So having females on the programme from historically underrepresented groups, sharing their lived experiences and inputting on the design of the programme will help us make a programme that's fit for purpose moving forward.